Hey what's up I'm Nizio Cole and yesterday Ubisoft released the Watch Dogs Legion Bloodline trailer to the world but before we talk about any of that we're gonna watch the trailer. Got a simple job for you Aiden. Huge payday. What's the catch? It's in London. That's where your nephew Jackson lives right? Anyway, the job's pretty straightforward. Break inside Broken Tech and steal a device giving control over an army of weaponized robots. That thing must not fall into the wrong hands. Whoa, 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 whoa. Easy, easy. I, hey, I know you. Give me that. This, uh, mm, three. I need it for a thing. Two. Okay, I guess we're doing this. Uh. That little device stolen by your partner. The one in the stupid mask? I can find him. I just don't think I can trust you without some insurance. I'm just tired of criminals and con men running the world. I need you to pay attention. So yeah, that was crazy. I was not expecting any of that. First of all, can we talk about the fact that Aiden and Wrench are going to be interacting? I honestly thought that there were going to be two separate storylines, one with Wrench and one with Aiden, but this just makes it so much better. Like, I love how different their personalities are and just being able to see them clash and they're actually fighting against each other. That would be crazy. Also something else, spoiler alert, by the way, but Bree is alive from the campaign which she died in the campaign, but now she's alive again in the computer. So as you saw in the trailer, Jordy contracts Aiden to go to London to steal some device from Broca Tech. And it looks like we do actually see Jackson in the trailer and actually being held hostage by this dude from Broca Tech. So that was insane. I honestly, the first few times I watched the trailer, I did not recognize that as Jackson. He just looks so different, but it is the future, so it makes sense. Now, along with the trailer, they also released an article to go along with it with more details, and I am really excited about the stuff that's in here. First of all, let's talk about Aiden's abilities. Aiden has Focus Mode, a damage buff with timed reload, and System Crash, which disables nearby electronics. Now, the Focus Mode is what I'm really excited about, because Focus in Watch Dogs Legion, that is going to be so great. I was a little bit disappointed that we didn't get Focus in Watch Dogs 2. Now, Wrench has a few more abilities. First of all, he has an MPX SMG and an LTL grenade launcher launcher classic wrench style he has a custom hammer named lady smash and he has mini flashbangs called ninja balls as well as a custom drone named sergey honestly i think ubisoft outdid themselves with these abilities these are great the only thing obviously that's missing is blackout but hopefully that comes sometime in the future both Aiden and Rent will be available to play throughout the entire campaign. Bloodline will add new main missions as well as resistance missions for Aiden and fixer contracts for Wrench. And we finally got a release date for Bloodline and that is July 6th. So if everything goes right, July 6th is when we will get to play as Aiden for the first time in 7 years. And this is the first time Wrench has made an appearance in the past 5 years. So yeah, this is really, really exciting. Honestly, I can't wait for this to come out. Hope you all enjoy this video. As always, let me know your thoughts on this trailer update down in the comment section below. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.